Hi everybody, it's Andrew from Launch27 and in this video I want to show you how you can manage your services. Now just a quick overview on what services actually are. Here I am on my booking form and if you scroll down to where it says choose your service and um, here I have a uh, here's my services one bedroom home two bedroom home etc and this is pretty much that what drives the pricing that shows up on the form right here so um so like i said this first drop down represents all of your services and the second one represents something called pricing parameters now a pricing parameter is uh, used for items that are mandatory for the service and that a quantity needs to be specified. So in the case of a cleaning company, they have um, services based on how many bedrooms are in a home. And as a pricing parameter, they'd have number of bathrooms because you know every, every home is most likely going to have a bathroom. And here they set a range from uh, having one bathroom to six bathrooms. And um, the next part I want to discuss is extras now these are also uh, known as uh, add-ons they're pretty much optional add-on services that customers can add to their main service so for each different service you can have different um, extras but in our case we added the same extras to every single um, service that we have so depending on what you choose here the price is going to change and here I change the bathrooms and you see the price go up so um, that's a quick explanation of what each different type of uh, service is. And now I want to show you how you can manage those services. Okay, here I am in my Launch27 account. And the first thing you want to do is go to the settings and the services section. So here's each service laid out. Um, you can change the display order by just hovering over an item and then just clicking your mouse and then dragging it. And that'll change how it's displayed on the booking form and what order it is, the display order. So I'll just put that back for now. And if you want to edit it, uh, actually I'll go over this page too. You can see a quick uh, summary of what pricing parameters and what extras belong to each service and the services price. So if you click on here, you see that same information. Um, if you want to edit like the name or the price, you can click this. You can also change the icons, it's um, stuff like that. Um, now, if you wanted to remove an extra, you can just click remove like that. If you wanted to add another one, you can start searching for it. And it'll like if I search for cabinets, It'll bring this one up and I can just set that, add it back. Or if I wanted to um, create a brand new one, say, let's say dogs, each dog is going to be, it's a quantity based and it can be uh, charged $30 per dog. And then you can choose which services you want to add it to. Click create, and now you can see it's added to my list. And it works also, this concept works the same way for the pricing parameters. You can remove it, or you can add a new one, um, and that's about it. So next, I wanna show you how you can um, manage your extras and the pricing parameters themselves. Here, you can only add them and remove them from the, the service. But if you wanted to change the pricing or this, the name or something like that, you have to actually go to the individual page here. So I'm on the pricing parameters page, same concept. You just, uh, here we have an edit button. You click on that, change the name, uh, the pricing, uh, whatever you want. Unlink them, link them to services here. And the same concept goes for the extras. So that's about it for uh, managing your services and the pricing for those services. If you have any questions, please contact us at support at launch27.com. Thanks.